Let's dive into how Citrix Spy can help you monitor and manage Citrix Zen desktop environments. First, let's see what Zen Desktop is all about. Citrix Zen Desktop is a desktop virtualization and delivery solution where desktops and applications run in data center and are delivered to end users over LAN or WAN to any device anywhere. As we can see from architecture picture, it is a bit more complex than typical Zen app environment and additionally includes Zen Desktop controllers, provisioning servers, as well as desktop hosting infrastructure. So, how do end users connect to their virtual desktops? First, they launch a web browser and log on to Citrix web interface, potentially via Citrix EQ Gateway. Then they are given a list of desktops that are available to them. In the next stage, they select the desktop they want to launch and use the desktops and possibly also applications installed either locally in the desktop or via Zen App servers. At the end, they close the desktop. How is the real end user experience monitored by the Citrix Pi? Secure Gateway, Web Interface and Zen App have already been explained previously. On top of that, Citrix Pi is also able to monitor desktop CPU and memory utilization if virtual desktops run on Zen server. Simulated end user experience has also been explained already previously, as web interface and Zen app servers are monitored the same way as with Zen app environments and provide great SLA monitoring and reporting. What about infrastructure monitoring? Secure Gateway, Web Interface, Zen App, Data Store and License Server have already been explained previously. On top of that, Citrix Zen Desktop controllers can be monitored for failures or internal issues, high desktop group use, low idle pool or failed desktop registrations. Provisioning servers can be monitored against failures, internal issues, device cache utilization, either RAM or disk, and high network load. For hosting infrastructure, if Zen server is used, complete Zen server coverage is available. And finally, with database, unavailability or data store inconsistency can be monitored. So let's take a look at the service map demo. Citrix Zen desktop service map is more sophisticated than that of the Zen app. First, we have Zen Desktop sites that consist of virtual desktop groups as well as Zen Desktop controllers. Then the next element are again infrastructure servers, in this case web interface and license servers are only shown. Then we have provisioning server farms that depict provisioning server sites each site contains a number of servers, like in this case we have only one server on site named Maribor. And we have stores. Stores are locations where desktop images are stored that are streamed to virtual desktops. In this case, we have two virtual desktop images in the store. And the last element is already familiar, Citrix Zen App Farm. In this case, we have two farms that help deliver applications to Zen desktop environment. Let's take a look at a few Citrix Pi sample alerts. Real end user experience monitoring alerts depict high CPU and memory utilization on a virtual desktop. Simulated end user experience reveals issue with XML broker availability and infrastructure monitoring alerts depict various virtual desktop issues, high RAM cache utilization, as well as high desktop group utilization and network load on provisioning server. A few more infrastructure performance reports and graphs depicting provisioning server disk cache use, average utilization of network interface cards, as well as top virtual desktops by CPU utilization.